on this episode of Juliana and Bill. We are going to go away to Mexico. We are going to have the Rancic Challenge Kid Edition. It's going to be very unfortunate when you lose. Okay. Go, Daddy, go! Whoa. Oh, my oh, my God. God. This is awful. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You guys should have kids. Why don't you talk about when you're going to have another one? We've got you, one. You need a friend. We she needs a one. friend. I think we want another child, but Bill doesn't even want to discuss it until we move to Chicago. You know, bringing a second child into the world, we'll talk. Can you see life with just one child? Yeah, you could. Yeah, loves the Windy City, honey. He likes taking strolls, I've noticed. He loves the buildings, look at him. Yeah, I mean, he's fascinated by the beautiful architecture here. He does love being outside, you know? Yeah. You know what we should do? He's in the city so much. We need to plan a vacation. I'm in. Where do you want to go? Anywhere that would require a three hour flight or less. Okay. Do you think it should be just us or should we do a group trip with friends? We should. This is fun when we travel with our friends. Yeah, that's great. Except for when we do that Rancic challenge, it gets a little competitive. Mr. Rancic, first place with 13. Because they're cheaters. Oh, okay, Coco. Just wait. Why am I a cheater, Colette? Because you're losing the game? I can't deal with all the hostility. So maybe we... Why don't we do a Rancic oh, no, I shouldn't even have brought challenge that kid edition, right? Uh, because all the people we know are competitive, and it's going to get ugly, and kids are going to cry. No, that's no, why. no. We're not going to... We're going to make it fun, right? You're right? Yeah? Bill, I don't think it's a good idea to involve kids in a highly competitive situation like the Rancic Challenge. It's not going to be a highly competitive situation with kids. Come on now. Well, you know what? Maybe we can find a place that has everything. So we can do the Rancic Challenge and also fun stuff like massages, the beach, you know? OK. Maybe Mexico. I'd go to Mexico. OK. Hey, Googie. Hi. All right, we go on vacation, though. We have to bring home the Rancic Cup. So much for not being competitive. I see Dave because of the construction project. Yes, but. Yes, yes. All right, so last time we were together, you guys were playing with the idea of maybe having another baby. We're very hot and cold on the third baby thing. You guys make cute kids. We really don't Seriously. have to. So I want to hear about the second rampant baby. Whoa, 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 whoa. I didn't say we're having a baby. I made a deal. When we move back here, then we can. You are moved back. We are all Didn't you buy a house? That doesn't mean anything with her. What do you mean? It takes a year to make a baby. He thinks we're going to have another baby, and it's going to be the day before we move to Chicago, and I'm going to go, you know what? But, I'm but so let happy me, but in let LA. Me backtrack. Let's keep let the me whole family here. Before we got married, we sat in a room, and we talked about what we want on a life with Sheena, make sure our goals were aligned. I mean, I took this very seriously, just so we knew there were no surprises down the road. And she said, let's get married, and a year after we're married, I'm going to move back to Chicago, I and we're going to live there. I said that? I have it in the notebook. We mapped it all. I, still, I kept it. That was seven years ago. Well, this is different. However, life has... Life has some bumps. Thank you. And that's the vows you took. That's right. You're thick and thin. Getting pregnant wasn't easy. Yes. True. No, no, no. You know what? I, I wouldn't change it for the world. Right. And you guys are who you are because of it. I would. Here's to kids. Cheers. And they all be and healthy and future and happy. babies, we will love them all. God bless. Dave and Lauren do bring up some good points about having a baby sooner rather than later. Or not having a baby right away. You know what? Maybe it is a good thing that we're going to Mexico so we can talk about this over margaritas. We are going to go away to Mexico. Oh. We're going to bring the little guy. Not just we. Farzan and Colette are going to come. You guys come with us. You bring the kids. Amazing. And we are going to have the Rancic Challenge Kid wow. Edition. Kid edition. It's the Rancic Challenge 2.0. Kids are involved in like Kids the events. Kids are involved. Your son doesn't walk. <laughs> he doesn't talk. He's got Rancic oh, DNA. Yeah. So what is it going to be? Hold your bottle contest? I'll explain once we get down there, but we're going to win. I think it sounds amazing. Yeah. It's going to be very unfortunate when you lose. 
Oh, well, some if map. you care to make any side bets, Mrs. Wells, I would absolutely happy. make a side bet. With our kids on our team, right. we'll take it. Here's the bet. Here's the bet. If we win, you do all the installation on our new house for free. Okay. Okay. If you guys win, I will pay full retail. Oh. Wow. Oh. Retail ransom has never been heard before, has Look it? Look at his face. I'm that confident. <laughs> Fine. I'll pay retail. But if I win, you install it for free. Done. Wow. Done. Done. Fred. This could get ugly now that money is on the table, honey. I'd kick Dave's ass for free. Ransack. Money is not necessary, trust me. May the best family win. Cheers. Adios, amigos. <laughs> Adios. Hasta luego, biatches. Should we chill? What do you want to do? Well, I think we need to get ready for the Rancic Challenge, honey. By the way, this hotel I found in Mexico where we're having the Rancic Challenge is... Tutto bene? There's golf, there's pools, and beautiful beach. You are not going to believe okay. this. We need to train for the Rancic Challenge, though. So I'm going to take you through what I call the Duke workout. Oh, God. Okay? So here's what we do. You put him on your shoulder. Okay. Watch, he loves it. And we do the Duke lunges, okay? Here we go. One, two. And this isn't embarrassing? <laughs> <laughs> and then we turn around. Dude, do you like it? He loves this. All right, fine. You gotta win this thing. Oh, he's heavy. Yeah, he is. All right, okay, ready? Honey, we gotta win this competition, okay? Bigger lunge, bigger lunge, honey. God, your dad's a drill sergeant. Open that gate up a little bit. Do what? You gotta get a longer gate. I don't even know what a gate is. Come on, Grandma. Can a grandma do this? Ow, that hurt. Oh. All right, now you gotta do some squats, ready? Duke, is this fun? Woo! All right, should we go get omelets? Now we're gonna do Duke push-ups. I'll take them, I'll show you how we do it. Lay on the ground. Do you want to see me do 50 go. or 100? Do 100. Okay. Oh, God, he's heavy. Come on. Ooh. Ooh. This. this sucks. Ow! Okay, she did three. I smell urine in this grass. Can we go to a park where dogs are not allowed next time I shove my face in the grass? And up we go. All right, this was fun. I think we are ready for the Rancic Challenge. We are, we're gonna win this thing. All right, let's go. All right, so I'm gonna go shoot news real quick. All right, that's fine, I'll All take right. him. Fine. All right, here we go. I'll race you, go. Hey guys. What's up, Paul? Not much. How are you? Good, okay. Um, before we do host wraps, I'm gonna do voiceovers. Okay. Is that okay? Yeah, sure. Because I did them at my hotel room with my equipment, and it sounds like they're really, it says urgent. It says urgent. These are not usable. This needs to be redone. They're coming off as if your microphone is 20 feet away from you. There's no exclamation points, but I'm just yelling anyway. Okay, ready? I'm going to start with the open. All right, three, two, Insider details on Paris Desiree Jackson tells us life. about the guy's ex-girlfriend who's Hollywood on studs show. who are only hooking up with hot models. DIY red carpet fashion. How you start off Hold by- Hold on one second, G. We're getting some uh, pretty good interference with that phone. We're, we're just gonna print them out for you, okay? Are we good though to, we don't have to go back, do we? Uh, you should probably go back a little bit, yeah, because that, that, those last couple ones were- All right. She needs a lot. So what uh... Which suitcases does she want? She wants all of them. All of them? Yeah, she needs all. Well, how many have you got there? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. What do you think, Duke? What, what does she think? She's the salt in the Brunei? I don't know, but she needs a lot. I got to call. This have you, is, yeah, I'm not maybe taking better. all these. I'm calling her now. And some are huge. Hello. This is crazy. Some are really, really big ones. And that'll take about three minutes to make up Hey, honey. Hey, honey, how are you? Good. Um, yeah, I'm at Gail's now, and your request is a little unrealistic. What does that mean? Cool. Well. I thought I was going to be picking up a few items. I had no idea we were relocating. That's all. <laughs> what do you mean by that? Yeah, that's You're not a, a Saudi prince, OK? Well, you know. We're only going for a week. But Duke needs a lot of stuff. It's not like we can just run down the street and go grab something. We're at some resort in the middle of nowhere. Who do you think you are, Madonna? I mean, Angelina would be better. 
<laughs> well, you know, she rolls with a lot of kids. She rolls with a lot of stuff. Everyone rolls with a lot of stuff, honey. I mean, if we forget something, then what are we gonna do? What are you gonna do? All right, let me just give you a little bit of foreshadowing here, honey. You've got all these bags. You're gonna get hung up in customs. We've got a baby with us. It's gonna be chaos. This is not a good idea. This is a first class resort. If we need something, I'm sure they're gonna have it for us. Fine. I have to go film some very important breaking news right now. All right, I love you, baby. Right, Goodbye, right. love, bye. Bye-bye. How many suitcases? I don't know, I'm not hauling all these bags. That looks like a, a suitcase for an accordion. <laughs> There's an accordion in there. Is, there. is that the accordion? There's an actual Maybe accordion. Maybe she wants to bring it's the accordion to Mexico case. too. Right. This is crazy. Beautiful. Gorgeous, huh? Honey, are they taking our bags right to the room? Yeah. Good. Look at this. <gasps> Duke, isn't wow. this beautiful? Wow. I can't believe we're already at the resort. Yeah, Duke was a champ on the plane. He didn't sleep much, but we've got the rest of the vacation to have fun and relax. Yes. I cannot believe this was only a few hours away from Gorgeous. Home. Hi. Juliana. Bienvenidos. Nice to meet Welcome you. Welcome to Rose with Mike Coba, Graham Davis, Managing Gracias. Director. Gracias. Bill. Gracias. Good. Let's Gracias. go this way. Well, all of our suites are on the water, so we're going to take a boat ride to your suite. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. Follow me this way. Is this so a river here? This is one of our natural lagoons, which we have over 250 species of wildlife flying and floating all around the lagoon. Wow, I see all these fish right now. Oh, Hi, thank you. Welcome Chaya Mojito. Wow, Very refreshing. Thank you. Mm. Salud. Wow. So, big vacation. Mm. And our friends are also coming with their babies. We've never vacationed with all of our children, so this is going to be very exciting. Uh, it will be. Wow, well, welcome aboard. So nice. We'll on the boat. Wow. All this right, is fella. nice. Duke, you want to ride on the boat? Yes, enjoy your experience. Thank you. Can you say gracias? Oh my God, this is beautiful. Duke, do you love Mexico? All right, come on, buddy. Right, we're going to disembark. Here we go. Welcome, Mr. Rancic. Well, thank How you, was sir. the boat ride? Oh, uh, like you love the boat ride. Thank you, sir. Hola. Uh, welcome to your right, suite. I want to show your suite. Come thank on, you. fella. It's like nothing I've ever seen before. Holy It's Toledo. so beautiful. You're going to love this place. Uh-oh. So, Colette, uh -oh. I can have everyone's attention. I want to thank everyone for coming to Playa del Carmen. Starting tomorrow, we will begin the Rancic Challenge. And we've reworked some of the challenges to incorporate the kids and make it a little more family friendly. Uh, but I thought since Colette and Farzan are still debating whether or not to have children, I was hoping that the Wellses would rent one of their children <laughs> to the two C's because all the challenges involve a child. So are you guys in? Yeah. So to get you guys in the spirit of the games, this is your kit. Can we open it now? Yeah, sure. Farzan and Colette. Oh, yes. Hello. Dave and Lauren. Oh. Put everyone in the spirit oh. of the games. Oh, oh my God, this is awesome. Oh, we are the yellow team. You got team. yours. Yes, You're so the green team. Have a pair of wow. Wow. Look at that. We are team blue. Yay. It suddenly got quiet and competitive at the table right now. Lisa, this right. is amazing. Please Thank you, Please be in your uniforms tomorrow. 8 a.m. When do we find out what the challenge is? Yeah, we'll find challenges? out the day of, which will be tomorrow morning. They're going to involve a kid in the challenge. You will need a rented child for all challenges. The kids are in all if challenges. If we win, yes. can we keep the child? If you win, you get both, two for one. <laughs> you guys should have kids. I agree. I'm thinking about adopting from Cambodia. 20 year olds. <laughs> Just pay for college. Community no, college. After, after college. <laughs> this trip, you're going to decide whether or not you want to have kids. You know, it's a good uh, a good beta test. Why don't you talk about when you're going to have another one? We've got you, one. You need a friend. We've she got needs a one. friend. We'll see. Someday. We've got our hands full with one baby. Having two or possibly three, I just don't know. Honey, Dave and Lauren have two kids, and they're perfect. How do you like vacationing with the two? It's good. One of the big differences between a family vacation and a romantic adult-only vacation is it's really hard to break away and like just do something romantic. You know, that's the only thing is I kind of miss 
you know. So why don't we trade out with kids? Swap it out. We'll watch Duke if you watch Mason and Kendall. I like that idea. A little okay, barter. Well, you keep hitting your head, boo boo. All right, let me get him out of here. Hang on. He's tuckered out. What were you guys saying? That we'll swap? We could hang out during the day. We could like have a nice lunch. You guys Mommy. watch the girls for us for a little while, and then you guys can Mommy. go to dinner, and we'll put him to bed if we remember how to do that. Ah, yeah. You like, you that, like idea? that idea? All right, we'll, we'll figure out a good time for that. All right, so we have a deal. We got a deal. I don't know how long it's been since we've had a nice romantic evening alone. We have a lot to make up for, honey. We if you know what I'm talking do. about. Boop, 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 boop. Sexy time. Okay. <laughs> Good luck to everyone tomorrow in the Rancic Challenge Classic. May the best child win. Oh! 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 <laughs> All right, let's do it. All right, welcome to the Rancic Challenge. This is the first year for Duke Rancic. Hopefully this will be a tradition that he carries on among his friends and his kids one day. So for the first challenge, uh, we've got these boats here. One of you from the team is gonna be the swimmer. The child will be in the boat in tow. You have to go to the end cone, touch the cone, and come all the way back. Two teams go head to head. The winner of each heat will then compete in the final round of this first challenge to get the maximum amount of points. So what? I'm lost. The Rancic Challenge couldn't be any simpler. Four teams, four events, the team with the most points at the end wins. Yeah, sounds very simple. This is the Rancic Cup, which will be displayed on the winner's mantle for the next 12 months. Sid, we gotta win that cup. Represent it with pride. So that's our cup right there. So wow. let the Rancic Challenge officially begin. Here we go, buddy. All right, Mace, it's me and you. I'm scared, I don't even understand the rules. Swim, just take the line, guys. Line. Set. Swim. Woo! Wow. Babe, go Greg! Go Greg! All right. That was an upset. That Dave, was that was crazy. pathetic. Well, Elsie, you are uh, <laughs> out of this round. Fun. Team Cole Shriver advances to wow. the final heat. So this is Bill against Farzan? Yes. Yep. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, you guys, Parsons, take your mark. Don't Get set. Go! Go! Go, Kendall! Oh my god, Parsons not bad. She's a weird character. Come on, Dale! Go, baby, go! Go, Faster! Go, Dale! Parsons! Faster! <laughs> All right, this is the final round. It is Team Blue versus Team Yellow. Go! He went to the spa. That's smart. Which I think sounds amazing. We have the kids, Coco. Well, that means you can't go to a spa? I don't think so. I mean, this is more of a family vacation, you know? And maybe if we could get rid of the kids. <laughs> I don't love your choice of words, but I get what you're getting at. <laughs> is that possible or is that not possible, being a mom? What are we going to do? There's no baby day camp at spa. So you have a baby and life's over? No more relaxation? Correct. <laughs> you hit the nail on the head. That sounds really appealing, Juliana. <laughs> Lauren. What, honey? I was just talking to Jules about maybe going to spa. If you guys can, like, the kids. I was saying that we're on a family vacation. It's not exactly easy to go spying. Well, what if we, like, barter a trade with the boys? 
Like we give them a little bit of time to do something. Can someone show me the beach. Hey, what's up, Dookie? Pose down for the girls. Come on. Goo goo. Look at him. He's gangsta. He the beach cute. is that away. We were just talking about how we weren't expecting to go to the spa because we're with the kids, but Lauren had a good idea. Yeah. Yeah. We get to escape to the spa for a little while, and then in trade off, you guys can go figure out something you want to do, and we'll take care of the kids. Yeah, we'll no, go golfing. That's not a bad idea. I haven't golfed in years. Can we bring the Duke with us? Of course. It's the a guy's golf trip. Course? Of course. Isn't there like a club here or something? Yes, they could go to the kids' club. They have to be oh, all yeah. be potty right. trained. He's not potty trained. What's wrong with your kid? He's not potty trained yet? Are you serious? Duke, what's wrong with you? I like it. I like it too. All right, good. What a genius idea to vacation with our friends. We can babysit each other's kids and have like a little adult time for ourselves. I wish I could do this every month. Oh, this is beautiful. Oh my God, this is amazing. So oh, pretty. It's so, so peaceful. Relaxing. Oh, it's nice to be in the quiet. I mean, the ability to have quiet, I, know, I think is right? very interesting. You have kids and they're not here right now. Which is lovely. It's amazing, isn't it? But it's also nice to have them. Cars and I are trying to figure that out. Watch you guys with kids on a trip because we travel so much. So we're trying to see if see how it goes. See if you're sane. You know what the key is? What? Good husbands. Yes, that's true. Who are good with the kids. Yeah, and will allow us a little bit of time to get away from all of it. But do they get mad when you come back to the room? If I'm gone a certain amount of time and the yeah. baby's been driving him crazy, yeah. But what if we started to have champagne here right now and it took four hours? <laughs> No, Bill, you can't tolerate it as, like yeah. he did before. Well, wait until you have two. Well, actually, it gets harder in some ways, but it gets easier in other ways, too. Why? How does it get easier? Because they have each other to play with. So like when I left, yeah. David was sitting on his phone and the girls were playing with one another. What about you? She has two, I have one. Are you going to have a baby? Do you want another one? Are you going to have another yeah. one? That's an amazing question. Mm -hmm. Yeah. After a lot of back and forth, a lot of soul searching, a lot of late night conversations and long walks, where we talk about this, mm -hmm. I think we want another child and we want to start the process sooner rather than later. Yeah. But Bill doesn't even want to discuss it until we move to Chicago. I have another year and a half on my contract. By the time we move to Chicago, Duke is going to be close to three and that's when we're going to start trying to have another kid. I don't know, I think I gotta talk to Bill about this. You want another boy or girl? I think girl. Girls when I bad. wanted four kids, I would have wanted another boy next. Yeah. But now that I'm yeah. like, I don't know, I might tap out at two, I want a girl. You want a girl. Well, let's see if you could do another one. I think you should do it together. It would be easier be if we did cute. it at the same time. Hi, how are you? Hello. Yes, 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 we're very we're ready. very excited. We're so excited. All right, show us how it's done. Oh. <laughs> Say, Mr. Wells, are you taking a penalty stroke? I'm going to try to go over this tree. Uh -oh. oh, that's a stroke. Uh -oh. Ready to see Daddy hit? Oh, look at this. <laughs> that, my friend, is how we do it where I come from. You see that, Duke? That's how we do it. We got to beat by three strokes. Beautiful hole. The little man's not even awake to see it. You're lucky you got a sleeping kid. Well, I think I'm gonna just put him on your lap. And then I'm gonna take him home after this hole. I'll let okay. you finish up. He's gotta get a nap in. Okay. Come on, baby. Get another dance good. floor. I think I'm just to the left of you. Okay. You play 100 <laughs> rounds a year. <laughs> See if you're on the green. We're gonna finish this hole, but after that, I'm out because Duke needs his nap, but. Had he not been sleeping, Wellesley would have taken a beating. It's a good day on the course, huh, fella? Here comes mommy. Uh, oh, oh, yeah, throw yeah. that bottle. Give me you little cougars. Oh, uh, wild man. Did you have fun playing golf? He was great. Hi, Cookie. He's good. He, he, he was a good boy. You know. You did it? He wasn't ready for 18 holes, but that was to be expected. I was going to say, because I didn't expect you guys to be back. No, but he so loves soon. the golf cart. 
Mm -hmm. Even though he didn't right. make it the whole time, at least we're spending such great quality time with the baby. Oh, it's the best. This is nice. We're having fun, aren't we, buddy? Maybe I can get Bill a little tipsy on some tequila and I can bring up the second child idea again. Duke was already our miracle baby and to have a second miracle would just be such a blessing. It's great that we're spending quality time with the Duke, but we need to have a little mano y mano time, if you know what I mean. Yeah, we should spend some quality time together. Yeah. All right, well, we'll take the wells up on their offer to watch Duke. But what someone's got to get wiped out first. Look at all your milk all over you, Can you grab Cookie. Another rag right there? <laughs> Hi. That's so cute. Welcome to round two of the Rancic Challenge. Woo! So far, we've got a very tight race. As I recall, we are kicking everyone's butt after the Toa Kid race. Team Blue leads with two points. Team Green, second place with one point. Ooh, 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 let's crush them. Well, I didn't think you wanted this to be competitive because of the kids. That was before we were winning. This is a good old fashioned balloon toss. Each team has to carry their child or rented child in one arm. You pick up a balloon, toss the balloon to your partner, the partner tosses the balloon back to you, and then you step back. Mm -hmm. If the balloon breaks, you're out. The team who makes it the farthest wins. What? I don't know how that works. All right, Seriously? I need to see so let me it explain visually. This to you. Here, okay. I'll do it. So here's how it's going to be played. I'm going to throw right, it to you. Kid? Oh. You throw it back to me. Oh, throw it back. And then, and then we take a step. Throw and it. one person's holding the kid. Throw it. One has to hold the kid. And that's out. All right, let's do this. OK, here we go. Bill, you're going to hold? Yeah, I'll hold him. OK, ready? Oh, good throw. Step back. Okay, ready? Feel that ready? Yeah. Yeah, you're still, still alive. Still alive. Still alive. Toss it back. Toss it back. Mason, you have to hold on. Okay, ready? Ready? Colette is never going to have a baby. <laughs> Good job, Colette. You can put her down for a while. Go right to mommy. Come here. Right, Come here, baby. Ready? Okay. Here, Farzan. Parents of the year, the two seats. <laughs> <laughs> you guys ready? Yeah. What kind of toss is that, woman? Unbelievable. Are I mean, you serious? The wells are officially out. <laughs> you threw that 500 miles we go. Ready? Yep. Oh, yeah. Woo! Okay, here we go. Come on, Rancic. Wait a second. Oh, I promise you that it. You're going to hold on to Woo! Ah! We did it, we did it, we did it. We did it, fella. Oh. Nice throw. <laughs> <laughs> nice throw. Okay. okay. Nice throw. Team Cole Slimer <laughs> is out. Team <laughs> Cole Slimer is out. Go, hurry. Oh. Okay. The hair balloon. <laughs> They're not even catching it. I want that balloon check. <laughs> All right, the Rancics and the Tussies. All right, ready? Yeah. This is it, honey. Uh oh, that's a popper! Oh, that oh. Was it. Oh. 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 All right, hang on, you gotta catch it now. Hurry up, Juliana, go! Oh, that's no chance! Oh, no. Oh. Oh, my God. Oh. We oh, win! Oh. Bro. <laughs> no, no, you gotta, no, you gotta you complete gotta the challenge. No, 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 no. Okay. no you gotta, you gotta dance. Okay. Honey, you didn't throw it far enough. I know, the wind got me. It's okay. That was it's my right. fault. I love you. But we still have a chance. We, we still have a chance. This is it! Wait a minute, where's your kid? Hey, Duke, you want to go to Uncle Farzan? There's Uncle what? Farzan. Oh, I don't know, I know. about that. I know. It's some scary. Come on, all right, here we go. Unfortunately, Kendall's crying is not exactly helping Colette and Farzan with their decision to have a child. Crying? What crying? All right, go, go, quickly. Quickly. Okay, ready? <laughs> One. Go, Farzan. Two. Gotcha. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> he has to still, he still has to catch it. <laughs> Why is Duke crying? He never <laughs> <laughs> that balloon doesn't break. All right, all right, here, I'll take, him, I'll take him, I'll take him. All right. That thing won't pop. I got it, I got it, I got it. We win. The two the C's two have C's won this round. Good job, honey. All right, come on, come on, let's go get a bottle. Come on. Ah, <laughs> Good job, Coco. I don't know how you guys managed it. I don't know either. <laughs> Okay, round three, sand burial. Oh, man. Husbands bury their spouses in the sand. 
from the neck to the toes, every part of their body has to be covered. First team to bury the spouse wins. So pick a bucket, everybody. Your kids are allowed to help, and we'll start on my command. Okay, dig, hands off your buckets. Hands off the buckets. Go! Oh, that's a, I got bad sand. Mason, dump sand on mommy. Bury yourself, bury yourself. Arms, arms, down, 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 Sorry, down. Dad, put your arms in the mouth. Sorry, 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 honey. Look, stop moving, honey. stop moving. <laughs> Done. Booyah! You can come up. Too bad you married a six foot giant. You can tell these guys didn't grow up on the beach. Bad technique. Don't move. You're, you're unburying yourself. Bill, use your hands. Done. Did we come in first? Yes. Team Wells came in first place. Team Tusi second place. Rancic third. Shriver Cole fourth. Wow. All right, let's go, fellas. Come on. Let's go, Duke. Let's go. Ugh, oh, we kind of blew that one, honey. We are tied with the Tusis, followed by the Wellses, and now in last place, Pam and Greg. All right, so how do we win this thing? Well, the final event is double, so it's literally anybody's game. All right, we're gonna reconvene later this afternoon for the final round. So Julianne, I just went to put Duke to sleep in the other room. The girls are in good hands. Good luck. Yeah, have fun, guys. Yeah. Enjoy, yes. enjoy. Thanks so much. All right, girls, Bye, here guys. we go. Bye. We're gonna create a lemonade stand. Have you ever had a lemonade stand? No. You've never had one? So now we gotta make some signs advertising our products. Okay? Why don't we play hide and seek or something? These girls are having the time of their lives. So we gotta put our price on there and we gotta spell lemonade. Today we're babysitting for the Wells so they could have a little bit of alone time. And this is gonna be really good for us because we can see what it would be like to have two children to take care of. Hmm. You have good handwriting. Wow. Now what's the next letter? Lemon and good. Hooked on phonics. Thank you. D, 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 another no, that's D. That's not right. Lemonade. Oh, no, sorry, that's all right. <laughs> Lemon duh. All right. Okay, so Uncle Bill played his game with you. You guys want to play an Auntie Juliana game? We're going to play spa day, and we're all going to pretend we're going to a spa. Uncle Bill, you're going to give Kendall a manicure, and I'm going to give Mason a manicure. I don't think that's appropriate. What's that supposed to be? <laughs> Come on. You go like this. You pretend that this is red. All right, step right up to the spa. Beautiful. Mm. <laughs> Nails look quite lovely today. You have a beautiful cuticle. Is that bed. funny? So how was your day? Did you have a tough day at work? Yeah. You did? Those bosses, huh? They can be something. I can also draw a rainbow on your nail. It's extra five dollar. How's the love life? You got a lot of you got a lot of boyfriends? Yeah. You do, right? You dupe one of them? Would you like an extra hand rub? It's just five dollars. What are you doing? You're not gonna draw on me, are you? You wanna draw my hand? You wanna give me a tattoo? Okay. Oh boy. Oh boy. What? Oh, oh wait, oh hi Kendall. Okay, thank you. Wow, thank you. All right, now are these washable? Thank you. This is fun. Oh, Kendall, all right, gosh. So many tattoos, so little time. I gotta be honest, I'm having a lot of fun with Mason and Kendall. Those kids are the best. I told you, see, two are as easy as one, don't you think, honey? <laughs> I like your braids. Yeah, those are pretty cool, guys. Should we braid Uncle Bill's hair? Yeah. <laughs> Someone's at the door. <laughs> hey! Yeah. They're oh, alive! Oh, they're alive! Yeah. How are you guys? So they were good? So amazing. They were so good. Really? Yeah. yeah. Now, I do have one question before we go. Auntie! Does this come off with soap and water? <laughs> <laughs> Just curious. This is the final round of the 2013 Rancic Challenge. The points are double in this round, so literally it's anyone's game. We are going to have a taco eating contest. Oh yeah! Seven minutes to eat the most tacos. Now I have to warn you, these tacos are very Mexican. They have a tremendous amount of spice. <laughs> Each team has a dozen tacos. If you quit, you're immediately disqualified. It's okay if we don't win, but it's very important that the Wellses don't win because me and Dave have a big bet happening here. This could cost me a fortune if things don't go the right way. 
You better eat through your pain, honey. That trophy has got to be ours if it kills you. No pain, no gain. Yes. So the kids are not involved in this because it's right. not safe, but they will have a special treat as soon as we're done. All right. Okay, any questions? No. Okay, Ransom Challenge begins in five, four, three, two, one. Go, Daddy, go! <laughs> oh, oh, my God! Oh. Mm, I'm sorry. That's too hot. That's too hot. Mm -hmm. it's too hot. Daddy, eat it! This one's too hot, man. Colette, isn't it hot? Eat, Daddy. Eat. <laughs> I'm gonna puke. Mm. Woo! What is on here? Awful. It's awful. It's hot. I don't want to win. Mama, Come on, honey. It's so hot. So is mine. <laughs> oh, my tongue's on fire. Oh. <laughs> Tough it out. Tough it out. You can do it. I give up. It's not worth it. Out. My daddy's winning. <laughs> yeah. How much yeah. time is left? One minute left. I can't do it. It's too hot. It's too hot. What's the Mexico 911? 30 seconds. Both together. Put, Shove that in your mouth. Shove that in your mouth. Put the whole thing I in. I can't. There. I can't. Just stop it in your mouth. Hands up. Daddy won. Well, Team Wells took first place. Rancic second. Tusi third. <coughs> now, I'm seriously going to die. I just want to say everyone was a winner today. There's really no losers. But in the first time in the 10 years the Rancic Challenge has been going on, we actually have a tie. We have a tie? We have a tie. Wow. Are you serious? Yes. Since it was a point system, the Wellses and the Rancics Woo! are tied. Woo! If we're not going to win the whole thing, I'm glad there was a tie between the Wells and ourselves. Yeah, it could have been pretty costly. <laughs> we share this cup until 2014 nice. with the Wellses. Six months on Got your it. mantle, six months on the You know what, you guys, churros for everyone. Churros on the house. Woo! That was so painful. That was intense. Oh, my mouth still hurts. Yes, yes, yes. Wow. Thank you. Hello. Hi, Chef. Welcome. <gasps> wow, look at that, Bill. Oh, my goodness. We love seafood. So, you ready for a good meal today? Oh. Yes. All right, well, well, let's you. start. Wow, this is beautiful. Thank you, honey. Did you arrange all of this? I did, you know? <laughs> Since Dave and Lauren are watching Duke uh -huh. and uh, we got the evening off, I thought, let's savor it. This is nice. Let me take this off. It's such a gorgeous night. So I thought Duke did pretty well on his first official vacation. I agree. He was definitely, he was very good. He was, um, it was more enjoyable than I had expected because we went a long time without having kids. Yeah. Um, it's a much different type of vacation than we've ever had. But I like it, you know? It's a, it's a good uh, next chapter in our lives. Question. Do you prefer family vacations now that you've experienced one? Or do you prefer vacations like we used to have pre-baby? Wouldn't trade this for the world. It's fun. I love hanging out with Duke. I mean, he's my main man. You know, we worked very hard to have him. And now that we have him, you know, I'll, I'll never complain about it. I cherish every minute we have. Yeah. But I have to say, after spending so much time with Dave and Lauren's kids, having two close in age is very helpful because they play with each other a lot. And I feel like out of all of us, Dave and Lauren seem the least stressed because they have a system going. Juliana has made it very clear that she is ready to have a second child, but I'm still not completely convinced that we're ready to bring in a, another child at this point. <laughs> yeah, no, well, we'll see. I think that's a bigger conversation. You know, bringing a second child into the world. We'll talk. We're here. Let's talk. <laughs> Can you see life with just one child? Honestly. Yeah, I could. You're fine with that? I think I am. Here's the thing. We were planning on going to Denver anyway. And we obviously go back and forth a lot on when we want to do it, if we want to do it. So. Maybe we just go to Denver and let's just go see what our options are with Dr. Schoolcraft and just kind of well, see what he thinks. Who knows if Delphine will even want to do it again. That's what I mean. Let's go just, let's just see what our options are. I don't even think we know what our options are yeah. yet. I'm a man of my word and you know, I made you a deal that when we move to Chicago and we get settled and we plant some roots, then we do it. So 
You know, we've got the house that's under construction. You know, we're getting closer to making that move, and when we do, then, then I'm all for it. Here's the thing. We are planning on moving to Chicago. The house is going to be ready in less than nine months. So if we go to Denver and everything goes well, we might, you know, the wheels might start turning before yeah, we no. expected. What? What? I know what you're going to say. Your old motto? Fool me once, shame on you. Fool me twice, shame on me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, but... Once we got married... Oh, God. One year, then we'll go back to Chicago. It's been seven. I got hustled. To be continued. On the next episode of Juliana and Bill. Would you be a good big brother? So does Delphine know? That's the question. It's a lot to ask. What if she doesn't want to do this again? What are we going to do? If we're going to have another kid, we should do it sooner rather than later. What if you can't have a second one? What are you going to do about that? What is going to give us the best chance of success? Two would be the best chance. Yeah, two could lead to twins. Oh, God. Yeah. We wanted to see if you would be open to being a surrogate again for us. Um.